Well, good morning and welcome to Friday. It should be Friday for you guys. Uh, we're actually crossed into the central time zone just a little bit east of Pensacola. And we're taking our first rest break here at the rest of this rest area is pretty unique because it's actually off the ramp off the roadway and almost looks like a campground to be honest with you um, I'll show you real quick but pretty cool uh, lots of parking spots bathroom facilities just a good place to take a break stretch your legs make coffee walk the dogs take care of the cats etc so, so far so good. A little glitch with little Gwendy this morning who climbed underneath the bed and had to be extricated by Marge. Thank God. Other than that, things are going pretty well. Hope things are going well with you guys as well. Stay tuned. We are on our way to New Orleans. We should be in there a little bit later tonight and we'll have you join us uh, on the trip. All right, so a quick break at the Alabama Welcome Center in Baldwin County. Easy access RV and truck parking in the back. Just take that first right-hand turn when you pull in. Don't do like I did and get screwed up with the signs. Good morning. Good morning. Very nice. Bathrooms are kind of nice. Let's take a look around this Welcome Center. Not seeing any coffee, so we'll have to figure it out. So do you work or volunteer here? I actually work for the you state. Act, you work for the state, wow. So we've stopped in here a couple of times on our way through. We're actually heading through to Texas this time. Okay. And we love your rest stop. Oh, thank yeah. you. For your welcome stop. Can right? I get your zip code? You may, 34609. Is there two people? There are. All right, thank you very much. So, so far so good, yes? Sure. Yeah. A little packed at the Mississippi Travel Plaza. We're uh, gonna take this opportunity to empty our poop bag and refill our water jugs. Nice area, not a lot of parking though for big rigs, agreed? Agreed. Yeah, a little bit tight, but enough, or maybe it's just everybody's taking their break at the same time. So, trip's going well. 
uh, things are going good. Cats are doing really well. We're actually giving them some water and cookies every time we stop. So that works out pretty good. Say hi to the wandering wades. <laughs> Hanging out. All right, so we'll take a walk uh, inside this Mississippi rest stop, I-10 westbound. I think it's Jackson County, Mississippi. And we'll let you see what it looks like inside. All right, so look at this. Jefferson Davis. Look at this staircase, guys. Wow. The king. It is a family channel. <laughs> Did Margie come out, Danielle? No. Oh. Boy. <laughs> well, we made it back to Slidell, Louisiana, where we were last year, and honestly, it was the highlight of the trip last year. The, the rest of it literally sucked. Um, but here we are, times two, and we are going to try and get our free Welcome to Louisiana t-shirts. We're gonna do the best we can. And we have Louisiana coffee. I hope that's coffee that's good. So let's give it a go. Welcome to the Slido Travel Project. So short story, we were here last year. It was the highlight of our trip. Oh, okay. 34609, I mean just this rest stop. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm not gonna, honest to God, we loved it here. That's why we're back. How many are you traveling in your car? Well, there's two for 09. Three, four, six, one, three. Two. And then I think Danielle is um, three, four, six, one, four. Yeah, two people. Yeah. How many nights in Louisiana? We so we're spending two in New Orleans on this leg, and then we're coming back and spending three. So, All right, so we're five total. That More great. if they don't kick us out. Did y'all need any maps or? No, we're pretty good. We're not gonna lie. We're pretty good. We're going right to we're going right to Legends Park and have coffee. <laughs> Well, I'll tell you what, you can start over here. We have free coffee already. I'm on my way. <laughs> on my way. Thank you. Oh, I don't remember the tables. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I suppose y'all. Yeah. <laughs> Almost half a destination. <laughs> Any issues with you guys? No. no. no good. Good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Bill, you notice they don't serve Pepsi here. Hot no. Or hot chocolate. It's because it's 9,000 degrees out. Hey, what did Bonnie say? If you don't drink coffee when it's hot, don't coffee. Bonnie says a lot of things that scare us. <laughs> Guys, leave a comment below with looking at that tree on what Valerie can't do. <laughs> she could wear one of the hats. She could. And it would fit right in. But but she can't put the star on the tree. She's gonna take the whole tree with her. <laughs> um, things are going well, right? Things are going awesome. Knock on something. We don't know what. But I don't know why you would even bring that up right now. To wait until we're there and then for trouble. Things you know, it's hard to take you really seriously well. when you're wearing glasses from the 50s. <laughs> <laughs> you like the 50s. I do like I the know. 50s. I know. What are you talking With about? With this whole tough attitude, you're five foot. <laughs> you got the hand on the hip. You're like. <laughs> I'm just trying to stay. I'm not talking. I'm not talking. All right, so we're here, New Orleans RV and Marine Resort off France Road in New Orleans. We made it, uh, we left at about eight o'clock this morning, but with the time change, it's now 4.30. 4.30. Several, several stops. We travel a little bit different than most people. We, we while well, we stop at each welcome center, you saw that you know earlier in the video. And we do like to take our coffee breaks and, you know, Lonnie and Danielle do have to walk the dogs, but it's a good stretch for all of us. Prevent a blood clot. Prevent a blood clot, yeah. And plus the 10 cats, um, they like to snack as they go and at least they get some water and we're able to clean up their litter uh, each time we stop so that the RV doesn't smell terrible. Um, Check-in? Check-in, easy. They, um... They go over everything with you. They give you a coupon, five dollars off. <clears throat> excuse me, five dollars off um, at the restaurant if you spend twenty-five. Um, and that's right code. above the check-in center, the restaurant, yes, right? Correct. Yeah. So as of right now, sorry, Valerie, uh, no alcohol. 
Yes, um, they just changed names. They used to be Punch to Train, which was why we missed the exit or the entrance the last time we came. Because I was looking for Punch to Train or whatever it is. Yeah, sure. Uh, sure. sure. Um, but it uh, changed to New Orleans RV Resort and Marina. Yeah, I don't think so. so. I, I think well, so. No, you that's probably what they said. well. But they don't know why I missed it. So you oh. probably saw in some of the video, this is a very industrial area. Uh, a lot of boat maintenance and so forth. And we just, me, I was driving the Thor at the time, just was not paying attention. Luckily, we were able to go down to the T intersection here and make a U-turn, back it up and get in. Whether or not we could do that with Storm and Norman, we do not know. Not good. So, no, not good. So there is a store in there? In there? Yeah. Yeah. And we'll take a look uh, a little bit later. We did do a... a YouTube review on this campground last year when we were here. Um, I will link that in the video description below. <laughs> no, I won't. Because I actually have no. You don't know how to do that. Nor do I know what that means. But anyway, uh, we're going to get set up. They're going to escort us all to our sites. And then once we get set up, we're going to have some dinner and we'll probably bring you guys along. I'm bringing my own hooch. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. 